ready to travel. It's gonna be a long flight, about 10 hours. What do you want to do on the plane? 11. What are we going to do on the plane? Watch a lot of TV, play video games, sleep, hopefully. We're looking out that window to see what's happening. Uh -huh. Today's our first day in Kyoto. We're here at the Kinkakuji Temple. Let's see what's in store for us. And then we're gonna check out another temple, the Fukuji Temple. Nice fall day, right? But we love it. Beautiful. Just left our Ryokan and our first stop is going to be the Kiyomizu Dera Temple. Then we're going to go to the Nishiki Market. And then we are going to explore some Gion. And finish up at the Samurai and Ninja Museum. Yes. All right, let's see what's in store. Today's itinerary in Osaka. Take the bullet train here. We're at Umeda Sky Building. Then we're gonna go to Daimaru Store. And then we're going to Osaka Castle Park. And finish up at Dantongori. My favorite 
thing was the unexpected sixth floor with all the surprises and feeling like a kid again. My favorite thing was all the food today. I just wish there was more of it because I loved it so much. anybody but window goes up and you just get the most amazing ramen best ramen fast food mm. it's delicious the beer too oh, what a more if you ask for simple easy delicious all right we're starting our hike we're into the samurai trail we're starting in nagiso and then we're going to Sumabajuku. and finishing up in magome maybe we'll see some samurai on the way halfway through this hiking through all these small samurai towns and might be one of the favorite things we've done while we're here in Japan. Yeah, it's gorgeous. Yeah, so get out to Nagoya and do this hike. It's beautiful. disc golf in another country and I can't believe it's Japan. Love this little course. Wish I brought a putter but a lot of fun. So thanks Jules for bringing me out here. We went to the Sensoji temple and did a little shopping there. And then we went to Akihabara, went to Super Potato, and then we went to Golden Guy. It's just this cool collection of tiny micro bars and got a really good recommendation for some just uh, low key sushi. Food was delivered right to our table. <laughs> We're at the Shinjuku Goya National Gardens. My favorite part was the view of the pond from the Taiwan Pavilion. It was gorgeous. Really like the rose garden and with the fall foliage. Robot restaurant. So much stupid fun, but it was over the top and everybody sold it. It was great. <laughs> Hi, my name is Mark. 
this is Mark's Tokyo. Uh, this is the menu we're doing for you today. Uh, we hope you enjoy. The soup was incredible too. That was just the opening dish and it was delicious. The favorite thing I had there tonight was Kobe beef. Fantastic. I can't get enough of it. I love that one too. Gotta make a stop in Bar Hermit, a bourbon bar. Had a 12 year Yamazaki that was really great. Also had their household fashion with some Japanese whiskey. Delightful on both ends. We decided to go to a restaurant called Sushi Yajima. A little bit off the beaten trail, had to go down some steps, find our way in there. We saw a sign that said reservations only. So we didn't think we were gonna get in. Walk in and they say, Okay, we can seat you, um, but you have to eat fast, 20 minutes or less. We had a sushi course of about 13 different items. They just cut and slice and put it in front of you and you just downed it right away. And, and it was just all amazing. It was made right in front of us by the chef and it was just his husband and wife. It was an amazing experience.